Hello world, welcome to SourceFed, I'm Joe Beretta. Hi there, I'm Elliot Morgan. Utilizing high-tech radar technology, science penetrated Earth's veil and uncovered a massive trench hidden beneath the ice sheets of Antarctica. The scar carved in the Earth's crust eclipses the Grand Canyon in size, meandering across the surface for 186 miles. Now to put that into perspective, that's the same distance as from where you are now to a place 186 miles away. It's also 15 miles wide and the gorge boasts a 1.8 mile deep valley. Reaching 6,500 feet below sea level at its lowest point. Now, science types who got their X Games on and mapped the Ellsworth subglacial highlands with airplanes and snowmobiles believe the chasm formed when Antarctica got all emo and decided to break away from the pack and sulk by itself in the corner 80 million years ago. All this movement of Earth combined with glacial force resulted in the impressive canyon. Legend says it was created by God's ice cream scoop. He likes vanilla. Super smart head scientist guy behind the study, Neil Ross, stated, To me, this just goes to demonstrate how little we still know about the surface of our own planet. The discovery and exploration of hidden, previously unknown landscapes is still possible and incredibly exciting even now. Super exciting! And it turns out this little guy called Earth is all sorts of ravaged on the surface. Back in September, we covered the 460 mile long canyon under the ice in Greenland. You can check that out by clicking the annotation or the link in the description. But hey, Mr. Earth, why are you covering up all your scars with ice? Don't be embarrassed. You're beautiful the way you are. You're so pretty. Those are not imperfections. They're beautiful. They're, you're beautiful. And no matter what your father says, if you work your ass off every day and stay focused, you'll achieve your dream of becoming a dancer. Yeah. Wait, we're not talking about Earth anymore, are we? I don't want to play football, Dad. I'm a dancer. All right, guys, what's the most beautiful picture of Earth that you have? Go over to our Facebook, post it, and then during comment commentary, we'll take all those photos and we'll make a beautiful montage of Earth that you will have been a part of. Or maybe we won't. It will depend on how we are feeling on Friday. It's really a toss-up. <laughs> yeah. We live in the moment. We can't just say we're going to do something. Yeah. I'm Joe Beretta. I'm Ellie Morgan. Bye-bye.